Hello, this is Vicious Goats. I got a uh, new pickup. I talked about this pickup a while ago, but it didn't come in the mail yet. It's a... Uh, many of you might know I'm collecting 63 Flare, and it's a pretty big stack of 63 Flare. Here it is. So, yeah. Um, don't have much to talk about it, but it was $64. Stack of 27. That might sound like a lot, because... There's only 67 cards in the set, including the checklist. And most listings on eBay are like a three-card lot for $100. So it's not that bad of a deal, actually. So uh, let's go through the fat stack now. I haven't even looked through it by myself. So here. See if I can get it open. Here we go. First one we have Tom Sheeney. Wait, that's two cards. Whoopsies. Don't do that. To number 27. Holy crap, I keep dropping these. Okay. Thick power. Shep Cottier? Cottier? Something. Number 28. Gene Freese. Really off centered there. It's miscut, actually. Joe M. M. Amalfitano? Amalfitano? 36. Number 36. Dick Farrell. Best name ever. 38. Al Jackson. It's not in that bad of condition compared to some of the other ones. Oh, well. It's got some type of... What is that like? Something there. Ruben Amaro. Number 50. Glenn Hobby. Cubs. I really like these old Cubs logos. Frank Stenhouse. Number 30. It's got some type of purpleness on the back there. Might be. Well, this came with a cookie. So I don't know. I don't think it could be gum. Frank Bowling. Bowling. For the Braves. Number 44. That's pretty cool. Number 44 for the Braves. But it's, he was a pitcher, obviously, so it's not Hank Aaron. Al Spangler. Number 39. Jimmy Davenport. Number 65, almost the end of the set. Yeah, there's 66 player cards and one checklist, so yeah. Art Mahaffer, Mahaffey? Mahaffey? Uh, Happy something. Number fifty four. John Callison for the Phillies. Number fifty one. This one's got a crease right here, but it's okay. Lou Clinton. Number six. I don't even know if I can say this name. Bill Mon. Mumblequet, 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 something. Number seven. Dick Donovan, another best name in the world. Number eleven. Tito Rancoa, Kona, Rancona. Crease on this one too. I don't know if the camera can. Oh yeah, I can. I think it's right there. But I don't mind. I'm playing. I'm paying for the player, not the condition. Don Lee. Well, this uh, this you can't really say for the players, because does anybody know who Albie Pearson is? I'm paying for the set. That's what I'm doing. Albie Pearson, number nineteen. 
Jim Landis, number 10. Ray Herbert, number 9. Another best name in the world, Dick Hauser. Wait, was that a duplicate? Was Dick Hauser at the front? Hold on. Give me a second. Dick Farrell was the first one, I think. Because I don't think it was listed as any um, duplicates. Yep, no. Okay, then you got Frank Larry, Larry. Number 14. And Leon Wagner. Number 21. Really off centered here. It is cool that we got a miscut. I actually kind of like miscuts. I've been seeing a lot of videos on them recently. Oh, wait, this Leon Wagner has a, a uh, crease right here. But whatever. Uh, I've been seeing a lot of miscut videos and all of that. There's an eBay listing right now. It's a 84 tops. It's miscut, and it's like the miscuts obviously have one un uncut sheet of miscuts, and he has the continuous of like eight or ten cards. So now I'm gonna put all these in, um, all my all these in the binder. I will speed this up so it won't be as long. It's probably gonna be like a 10 minute video for me, but whatever. Wait, that's backwards. All right, I'm back. Um, I finished putting all of them in there, and here we go. So I did a video on all of my um, cards I had before, like four days ago, maybe. And if you want to see what I had before, go watch that now. But it's mainly just the stars and hall of famers. So on this page, I added two card, three cards actually. Sorry. And on this page, I added, I believe it was eight. Yeah, eight. And then now I have four on this page. This is. I added a lot actually. Chuck Cottier, Gary Stenhouse. What is that like? Five on this page? Oh, and this is how it looks if it's the miscut. I can't identify that card since it's only um, the card below it because it's only just a little bit of blue. It could be this card. It could be really any card. I added a good bit of cards on this page. Well, only four, no, three actually. Sorry. I added, what is that? One, two, three, four, four cards on that page. None on this page. And one on this page. So yeah, that's all I have for this one. More editions are going to be soon. Just a lot of expensive 63 Fleer. Uh, I'm guessing it's on eBay at least. I'm guessing it's because of uh, it's just such a small set and nobody really collects it. So you can really charge whatever price you want for most of these. Hold on, let's move all this stuff away. You can really charge whatever you want for most of these because nobody sells them. So if you're the only person that sells these type of cards, you can charge whatever you want. Which I guess makes sense, but it's kind of dumb for people that are broke. Okay, I added all my things back. So yeah, that's all I have to show for today. Uh, more editions are soon. And bye.